Week seven pickums. Bum 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 da 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 da. Is that Jurassic Park? It Jurassic is Jurassic Park. Park. <laughs> it is Jurassic Park. YouTube is down right now. Can we actually upload this after recording? You guys will hear this when you hear it. Find out when we post it to you. Put too. Yeah, hopefully guess. we can post this on time. You pooed. Uh, <laughs> YouTube's messing with us, but there is you can see. Frogs, Angels, Leaderboards, Junior still in first. Danny catching him. He's in second. I'm still in third. Pete's in last. Did you Pete? just say Danny's in second? Yeah. The noob? Yeah. In second place over the back-to-back champion? Or is it back-to-back? The back-to-back, back-to-back, back-to-back champion's back-to-back. in last. Yeah. yeah the back, the back <laughs> flipped. We've done this two years on YouTube, and Pete's won both years, and he's just last place right now. How does it feel? It's an early season. Moments of shame. This is a weird season. Well, it's start to sort out. It's gonna turn around. It's it's for it's, you. It's still early. <laughs> it's tough to. Pete's tough, gonna end up winning come, this year somehow. They don't call him Girthy Peter for no it's reason. Tough to he's, come back. He's, gonna, well. he's, he's a late bloomer. Late bloomer. Uh, presented by FanDuel. If you didn't know, links in the description. You can play FanDuel, Gridiron, pick them. You can pick every game. You get them all right. You win 10K. There's other games you can play if you're gonna play FanDuel using the links in our description. And if you still don't know, that's 10 with three zeros. Would be uh, much appreciated. But let's just get into it. Broncos versus the Cardinals. Uh, Let's go, Broncos. Let's go, Broncos. Uh, Broncos, Cardinals. That's the that's the Thursday night game. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Um, Maybe yeah. We'll get some cool color rushes out of it. I mean, the Broncos. The Broncos are better at home. They're not good away. They could lose this game, but Ooh. they're still a they're still a better team. I'm going to go with the Broncos. Interesting. Step in, Danny. Take it away. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and step in, and I'm going to say, yes, the Broncos do not perform well away. Somebody with the Cardinals. You're Shock. I'm shocked. You're shocking I'm the world. Hey, I'm shocking myself. Have fun and this week in second place while it lasts. Shut up. Because I'm taking the Broncos. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to go with Case Keesum. Ooh, good Pete, Broncos. speak up. Going with Case Keesum and the Broncos. Okay. Titans and Chargers. Uh-oh. Pete, you want to pick first? The London game. Ooh. It is in London. It's neutral. It's a neutral site. On uh, the pitch. The Titans coming off that pounding, and the Chargers are feeling it. What do you got, Pete? Chargers. Whoa. Going Chargers. Yeah. Pete's going Chargers. That's not a good sign. I don't know what I'm watching the last two weeks. I don't know what I'm watching. Can I go next? Go ahead. I'm going to take the Titans. <laughs> This is the wild I think, I think, I think I, yeah, seriously. I think I think uh, you know teams traveling to London. I feel like you never know what to expect. Yeah, that's true. So um, I think the Titans are gonna have a back bounce back performance. I'm a I'm a real believer in those sure, Titans over sure there. Sure hope so. I, I I can almost guarantee that they're not gonna have 11 sacks again, or I mean give up 11 sacks, I should say. But uh, yeah, I'm I'm feeling the Titans on this one. That's a hot take. And I like the Chargers think, a lot. I like. The don't Chargers think they're gonna give up 11 sacks. That is a hot take if I've ever Steamy heard. Steamy hot take right there all right what does junior got we're going out of order so i guess i'll go last okay junior's taking the bolts the bolts the bolt bolts up pete's concerning me here because he's not even taking his own team and danny's concerning me because i don't know what he's high on over second there. place he's uh, yeah he's feeling a little a little power I, I always have at least a couple uh the, the shockers second place to get into your head yeah, two picks in a row now hey i'm catching you won't be for long <laughs> Uh, I agree with Danny that London, uh, you know, has some weird effects, can change things. Change man. The Chargers are playing weaker teams, so maybe this is a little more of the test, but the Titans kind of look, I don't know if they are, but they kind of look like a weaker team at the moment. I'm going to take the Chargers. I think they're I think they're just better, but it shouldn't be by that much. We'll see how much better they are Sunday morning. Patriots and Bears. Season-defining game for the Bears right here. This is going to define their season. All right, you can go first again. Damn it. <laughs> well, I'm going to choose the Bears. I don't – I doubt it's going to – I doubt it. I'm doubting it. You're doubting it, but you're – But I'm believing it. in it. I'm going to go with the Bears. I think Trubisky's played well the past two, two – shut up. Uh, Trubisky's <laughs> played great the past two games. I mean, yeah, he's, he's missed some opportunities, but – uh Something I'm still excited about, the Bears got screwed over by the refs in, in the Dolphins game. Dolphins obviously won the game, but, uh, yeah, the Bears got screwed over. I'm still on the ride in the Bears hype train. 
it's going to be a tough test for that Bears defense, but it is at home, so that's why I'm going with the Bears. Bears. Well, I got a couple things here. All right, let's hear them. A couple things. First thing, you can never go against Big Tom. I've learned this the hard way a lot of times. But I'm also have made it very clear from from week one, I was never picking against the Bears. 16 Bears. All? No, I, I have them. <laughs> this is the weird thing. Another thing. Third thing. He has them 16 In my season predictions, they're in second place. But in these pick I'm never going to pick against them. Okay. See my predicament here? At least you're honest. I'm honest. Man of his word. I'm honest that I don't make sense, but I'm taking the Bears. All right, what has Pete got? What was Going that? Pete. Going Pete. Big Tom. Big Tom. Big Tom. Like, okay. like what I was saw. Like what I saw. Like what you were saw? Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> like what I was seeing. That's all I was going to say. But like, doesn't make any sense. Like what I saw Sunday night against the Chiefs. I think they're going to get it going now. This is going to be a good game. You know, is is Soldier Field going to be sloppy? That's the question. When that thing's sloppy, it's, it's going to be hyped. I can tell you that much. It's hard to play on. You know, it's it's different when the Bears are home. You've seen the Patriots fall to the Lions in Detroit. It could be a similar situation here. Um, I think Khalil Mack, I think he'll play, but him being kind of hurt uh, is is a factor. And I think the overall the Patriots – are the better team? Are I, you sh- are you sure though? Because I'm sure it's when good. when Danny goes to the game, he's three and zero. Oh. So Danny going? could be the deciding factor here. Are you if, going? if if the I'm Bear, going. if the Bears win this week, I will pick them the rest of the year when you're at the game. Fair, fair, okay, fair, okay, okay. Um, I, they could win it. They could win it. Um, but the thing is. The Bears didn't get pass rush on the Dolphins. They still probably could have won the game. Should have won the game. Should have won the game. That's fair. But the Patriots are a little different than the Dolphins. I think it's possible that they can be – they'll they'll get a sack. But it's possible they'll be very limited on those sacks because of the Mac injury and because of the Patriots. Tom Brady's so smart at the line, figuring, picking up blitzes, figuring everything out. And no matter what lineman they have in there, they seem to be good. They get new guy. They have new guys in there every year, and it's ridiculous. I don't know how it's the big time effect. I, I need you know. I need the Vikings to get whatever they got. What, what, what is it? A coach? I don't know what it is. Deflated balls. Deflated balls. That's, That's what, what it is. is. The lineman can block because of deflated balls. All right. We're on to something. We're on to something. Okay. I really yeah. like the running back duo too with Michelle and James White. Great, great duo. Maybe the best in football between for the duos. I'm saying. Uh, Bills and Colts. It's gonna be Peterman. Peterman is, is versus Peterman Luck. Official? Josh Allen, they're saying he could be out weeks. Well, Derek Anderson. Derek Anderson? Well, if Peterman's, yeah. then I'm definitely going with the Bills. <laughs> I bet they start Derek Anderson. You think so? I think so. I don't think it matters. I think the Colts win. I'm going to put myself in here. Is that everyone okay with that? Yeah, t- take uh, it away. I'll okay. tell you. I'm a little offended. Offended by that? A little bit. I, there, there's no meaning behind it. I just... It's what? a little disrespectful, but... Oh, just better I, watch th- yourself. But I'm going to jump in here and take not, the Colts well, he, as well. He's already... He's already okay. Sorry, Danny. I'm going to go with the Colts as well. Taking the Colts as well. Everyone's going Colts. All right, give me some time. Let me move them over here. All right. Everyone going Colts. If Josh <laughs> if Josh Allen was playing in 100% healthy, would anybody pick the Bills? Yeah, I actually, I actually, yes, I would. Yes, have. I would. Okay. That tells um, you that. I don't know if I would, but he's not playing, so. So we don't got to worry about that. Yeah, so basically, worry. I'm not answering my own stupid question. Yeah. Uh, all right, let me take all these guys down here, and we'll go to the next page. Lions and Dolphins. Dolphins coming up. Uh, coming. I don't know what I'm trying to say. All right, they, 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 they slipped out. by. They, they slipped by. by the Bears. They squeaked. Thank They're you. a little slippery. They, they squeaked by. They were by, at home in 100 degree weather. But but they did have Brock Osweiler in, and I didn't. I wasn't a man man to my word. Again, I said if the Bears lost to Brock Osweiler, I was going to move him to 32 in the power rankings. I, that wasn't serious, but I, I keep saying stuff that I don't think will happen. So you're not a man of your word. I'm not. I guess I'm not. I said I was gonna eat my underwear. I didn't do that, and then I didn't move the Bears to 32. So you're just a liar. Uh, I guess so. Wow. I think I got to start signing stuff so I actually do it. I don't I, know. I have a quick, uh, not really a question, but Is Tannehill you, back this week. I'm sorry. We'll He's still see. still day to day. That's a problem. We're picking too early in the week. But I kind of expect him to play. I think they were just worried about him getting uh, attacked by Mac. Eh. But even though little did they know, they weren't gonna let up a sack. And so they didn't even expect it. Can you get to my point now? Go ahead. Did you see the guys that were literally just there to hold shade over the place? Yeah. That was Why so wasn't funny. there like an? <laughs> no, you know that stadium was built so the at, at uh, noon kickoff, which would be what one o'clock for them, that the sun would be on the away team rather than the home team, where the shade. What kind of terrible job is that? You just hold up the smart sh- move. 
It's a smart move. <laughs> who who was it that said that the Dolphins have the best home field advantage because of the heat and because of the the stadium design? Is that their way of pumping in crowd? Yeah, but that, does that, that heat advantage? last that long through the year? I mean, in, for but the beginning half in. of the year, for half. Yeah, I think there's better home field advantages. I don't know. I, I think I think some of these shit fields. It was uh, it was Rex Ryan who said it. I'm pretty sure. Good old. Well, I mean, he had Rex to play Ryan. against them two times a year. So I mean. It's that's up for debate. I've heard I've heard multiple counts players don't like playing on uh on FedEx field, the Redskins field. Not a nice field apparently. Um same with Heinz Field, which is the Steelers, same with Soldier, the Bears. Because it's not on turf. The yeah, that would make the most sense. The the Eagles Well the cold the cold you get the cold ground and then it's just like mm. yeah. Uh, does anybody want to pick? This is actually a really tough one. Uh I'm gonna take the Lions. You're gonna take the Lions. Danny's not rolling with the Dolphins. Yeah liar i'm going with the lions as well whoa whoa i didn't i put judy there not danny <laughs> that was a mistake and it worked out for the best okay whoa <laughs> trying to trying to gain picks here but i wanted to pick the lions as well so am i allowed he, he's to do, gotta be better am i allowed to do if if Tannehill plays i'll take the dolphin no, no we don't do those this year yeah yeah apparently we don't do those yeah we don't do those pete all. one more word out of you pete we're minus apparently one. we don't do those put him at 48 uh, I'll a, I'll take the Dolphins. Should be a fifty. I'll take the Dolphins. Should be a, I'm a, should be if Osweiler plays, they're not going to win again. He's not going to go two and zero. Um, I'm kind of banking on Tannehill playing. I I think is it a case of the Lions just not performing away? For you? Kind of or the bye week could help. Games. They're a different team away. What did you say? Nothing. I I have no idea what you said. Uh, the Lions aren't as good away. They had an extra week to figure this out. But they also had an extra week to watch them with maybe the quarterback they're not even going to see. The Dolphins could the, – the Lions got some good pass rush this year. So it's surprising they got a good amount of sacks, but the Dolphins can block, apparently. Um, Allegedly. They can create turnovers in the secondary. Stafford, can't. he's good, but can throw turnovers, can throw interceptions. Uh, if Tannehill plays, I think they win in a squeaker. That's basically what I'm saying. Uh, next game is the Vikings at the Jets. I'll just start it off. Very close game. This is going to be a really close game. The Jets are looking good. I think uh, I I think they'll score on the Vikings. People seem to think the Vikings defense is back. Uh, they're getting there. They're not back. The Jets are better than people think. Maybe the Vikings aren't as good as people think right now. But the bottom line is they're they're on paper they're way better and they should be better and they should win this game. Nothing else. So I got to pick them. I think it'll be tight though. I'm going to go with the Vikings as well. I really wanted to choose the Jets, but uh, if you note my previous picks, and if I'm playing for the points, I can't have a lot of uh, upsets this week. So um, I'm going to go with the Vikings. Pretty One more thing I can add. Um, they really blitz Rosen, the rookie quarterback, and Kirk told the defense to do it pretty much. I don't know if that's why they did it. I think Zimmer already made up his mind earlier in the week, but – I think you say Kirk told him to do Kirk, it? yeah, the pregame speech he told. Kirk him. ran the defense then? Yeah. Oh. He's calling plays, yeah. No, I didn't say he ran the defense. I said before the game he told him, he, you know what he said. He said he would – what did he say? <laughs> said the he, defense finger it out? Yeah, no, he said the defense – he told the defense he was a rookie quarterback before, so get out there and hit him every play, basically. Not exact words. Uh, I said that Zimmer made up his mind earlier in the week, and that's why I was kidding with the Kirk Cousins thing. But oh, um, Pete didn't catch that apparently. No, but I think they seem pretty serious. I think the Jets will see something similar in the blitz packages from the Vikings, um, but they're watching film and they'll see it. So we'll see if they pick it up. That's what I wanted to add. That's twice. I got. Twice. I got some to add. We got uh, the Vikings have had uh, their struggles with the rookie quarterbacks this year. Um, but I'm taking the Vikings here. Not Josh Rosen. Josh Allen. No, Rosen had some flashes in there. Yeah, and garbage time. In, yeah, but I'm still counting those as flashes. Garbage time is still still time. In, in time. Yeah, we're going with the Vikings as well. Okay, thank you. Thank that you. is all. <laughs> thank you, that is all. Panthers, Eagles. Ooh. This is a Ooh. tough one, actually. This is a tough one. Uh, I'll go ahead. In the tough ones. I'm going to take the home team. I like to stick with the home team. I went against it last week, and you know I didn't come up, come away with as many wins as I wanted to to come away with. I'll take the Eagles. Think they think they figured it out. I think it'll be high scoring though. I think it'll be Ooh. high scoring and a close game. 
Eagles win because they're at home. Can the Panthers put up a lot of points, though? That's the real question. They could. Uh, they could do like it. That. I'm going to go with the Eagles and a squeaker. Eagles and a squeaker. I'm, I think it's going to be a uh, relatively low-scoring ball game. Okay. Yeah. I, uh, I play the under. Saw something that was pretty interesting. Um, it, was the, it was the Thursday night game when the Eagles were playing. They brought up like a graphic of um, Carson Wentz's first four games this year versus compared to his first four games last year. And everyone was saying he's had an MVP season. His stats are actually better this year than last year. And I think just the rest of the team has been struggling, but they're going to start picking it up, and I think they'll get a win here. Yeah, they are. They're going to win here. You are you sound like you're guaranteeing it. I'm not guaranteeing it. It's just a tough one to Would say. Would you eat your be- underwear if the Panthers won? Uh, I already said I would eat underwear because you're not going to do it, so someone has Someone's to. Gotta do someone it. has thank, to do this for the for channel. Val- I'll do thank it. you for volunteering. I'll do it for us. All right. He's a man of his word. <laughs> Face reveal. I'll eat the underwear. Jesus. My own. I don't know if people are actually going to. No, yeah, I think they would tune in. We should that. get uh, whoever donated to do it during our live stream. We'll, we'll get him to send our, his no, underwear. I'm not we had four donations in our underwear. Friday live stream. Appreciate those guys a lot. Uh I'm, but I think you're referring to Bills fan donated a crazy amount. Yeah. Guy's insane. He's. I'm not eating any crazy. else's underwears, but my own. I think you would like to. Okay. All right. All right. Okay. Out of the Browns and the Bucks. The Browns and the Bucks. I don't know what to pick in this game. That's gonna be a good one, I think. Uh, so when it's gonna be a good one, we like to go with the home team. Yeah, I really do. I think. Uh, I think another game. Winston gets some action. I think he can figure it out here. I'll take the Bucks. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what you guys are laughing about. My, my foot made a funny noise. He turns to me. He goes, "Are you shitting?" <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, I'm gonna go with the Browns. Oh, Brown Town! I think this might be the first time I chose the Browns all year. To be honest with you, you're gonna bash yourself in the comments. No, actually, I'm. I, 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 I've just never been a believer of James Jameis Winston. I think the Browns are gonna win in another squeaker. A lot of squeakers this week. What does Pete got? I was going to let Ant go. He clicked on go. your name, though. The Browns let, are known for squeakers, I was going to let you though. go. Okay. All right, Junior's going. Okay. All right, give me the Browns here. Ooh. In a squeaker? I'm going to Brown Town here. Okay. The Browns are known I for squeaking. I think Baker's going to throw all over these poor oh, he def- will. These DBs. These poor, poor DBs. But I think Winston can do, do some damage, Winston too. Winston can't do anything. We're going to split it 50-50. Here. Ooh. 50. Oh. At home. 50. This is where Pete try to, goes down try to even gain more. Try to gain <laughs> some. Try to gain some points here. Somewhere. This is where it could go south, though. If you're trying to gain points, you can get behind by way too well, much. You got to pick the the close games here. You, gotta, you know look what I've been doing. I've been taking some upsets. I'm not going to take like. I'm not <laughs> you know what take, I've been doing in the close games. I'm not going to take like the Jets over the Vikings. Like this is. I've been going I, for the home team. If you had, Jets are about to be the Vikings. Not last like week said though. That. Okay, we're moving on. Moving on. Moving on. Next group of games, Texans are hot, Jaguars are cold. Who's going to win it? <laughs> you tell me. Yeah, you tell me. Not uh, up. I just, just because I don't see it, that's really not a good reasoning. And because they're home, <laughs> okay. uh, I'm going to take the Jags. Jags sometimes have an offense and they have a defense. Titans have an offense, but they don't have a defense. What? Texans? Texans. What did I say? I said Titans. Titans. I was like, what? <laughs> <laughs> It's I've like heard, it, I've heard it both. Op, complete opposite. <laughs> I, I've heard it both ways. You almost made Pete really mad. There. I think you <laughs> Texans. Did. We're talking about the Texans mad. here. No, 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 no. I'm taking the what? Jaguars, but not the. I'm, yeah, we're taking the. Just Jaguars. stop talking. <laughs> yeah, just. I'm done. I don't know what you're. Yeah. All right, we're going there. with Jacksonville as well. Why? Because they're not going. They're not going to lose. Because the Titans, right? Will you eat your underwear if the Texans win? No. All right, I'm going to do something shocking here. And I'm All right, gonna, right, let me oh. explain why real quick. Okay, yeah, okay. Yeah, 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 okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Texans have been getting really lucky like recently. Win the win. Yeah, they won two overtime games that they probably should have lost and both. And they beat Peterman. Yeah, and they were <laughs> losing, and then Josh Allen got hurt, and then Peterman just gave him the game. So no. That's what he's known for. Peterman scored a touchdown. I don't want to hear it. I don't want to hear it. What's Junior doing? Give me the Jags. That's it? That's all. That's all, folks. Maybe the game of the week, Saints, Ravens. Will the Saints go marching in to Baltimore? Get it done. Yes. Yes? Ooh. All right. I'm going to put Pete over Pete, there. go ahead and break it down for us. Um, You know, I'm not not sold on the Ravens. Even though they just kicked the crap out of the Titans. I don't. They did really lose to the Browns the week before that. But... Is, this, is this a revenge game in your mind? A little bit, yeah. <laughs> I got to... Sh- 
they're going to – I mean, the Saints, up, Saints offense <laughs> – Saints offense compared to the Titans offense, it's like not even close. Yeah, it's a totally different matchup. So I don't. I don't and the think. Saints got they the Ravens got to prepare for something totally different a week later while the Saints sat on their asses and watched film. No, I'm sure they worked out, but you get my point. Uh, I will take for those reasons. I'm taking the Saints, but it'll be a good game. Off at high powered elite offense versus maybe the best defense in football right now. Should be a fun one, folks. Junior, you can go ahead, buddy. Alrighty, I'm gonna take the Saints as well here. I just think, that, who's that? It's Junior. Okay. Yeah, it's me. I'm gonna take the Saints here. Um, this is gonna be a good game, and like you said, game of the week. But I'm taking the Saints. This could be another one where I'm just gonna drastically lose my position. I'm gonna You're go with the Ravens. Not gonna be in second place long. I'm gonna get, or I could be in first place. You never know. He may. He might be. He could be. He I, could be. This is a deciding the wild week. card. So this is a big week. For I us. think Ravens defense has shown a lot in the past three weeks. So I'm I'm feeling the Ravens here. Okay. Uh, Rams in Niners. All right. Three, I'm gonna go ahead and move Danny two, here, one, just because he's on the other whoa, side. Whoa, yeah. I'm gonna go ahead and drag these guys here. Okay. You didn't even ask me. Yeah, you're taking the Rams. It's true. I'm going with the Rams. Uh, even though they're not the home team, they're just better. The Niners played Best pretty. Team they should have beat the Packers. They should have beat the Packers. They, they, beat the they Packers. played pretty well, but the Rams are, I think, high powered. I think just a much better than the Packers because they actually have well oiled machine, more talent than just their quarterback, <laughs> lineman, and receiver, and whatever. The cool his wife or girlfriend or fiance, whatever she is. <laughs> <laughs> That was the most disgusting thing. I've you ever talking heard. about McCarthy? Oh no, who am I thinking of? <laughs> oh <laughs> shit! Yeah, no. <laughs> yeah, I'm thinking of McVeigh. Um, yeah, no, yeah, no, 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 no. Moving that on. Noise? <laughs> uh, another maybe one of the games of the week: Cowboys Redskins. Cowboys coming off a pounding. <coughs> they just <laughs> they pounded the Jaguars. They put 40 points on them. Sure word today. Yeah, they really. I don't know how many times I said it. I think you said it for the Titans Ravens. Did I say it? Yeah, you so. said the Ravens are coming off a pounding. It's all right. I mean, Did I, say, I said it just like that? Something like that. Yeah, we we so. live in America and everyone can get a pounding here and there, you know? All right. I agree. Uh, the Cowboys looking good. The Redskins are very good at home. Ah, um, somebody else want to go? I don't even no, know. No, it's all you. Oh, boy. Oh, yeah, I can go. I can go. Go ahead. I'm going to take the Redskins. Ooh. I think I think Redskins, they don't, they don't have that flashy player that uh, most teams have, but I feel like they're pretty even along the entire depth chart. So I really don't know why I'm going with the Ravens. But or, wow, geez, I can't speak today. I'm, I'm going with the Redskins. Yeah, I got gotcha. you. Yeah, 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 yeah. Anybody else want to jump in there? Yeah, I think for the first time in a long time, I'm taking the boys. Boys. This is maybe the one of the harder games. The Redskins have been balling lately. Besides the pounding, they, I, they, their defense. They took a pounding last Monday. Yes, but their defensive line has really impressed me. Really impressed me. For a team that we thought was going to be well, yeah, they were like awful. Bottom of the league in run defense last year. They really stepped this it is up. Good. This is a big game for the division, too. Jeez. Yeah, I'm taking the boys. This is going to be. Uh, this is this is a this might be the hardest one to pick for me of the year because the Cowboys coming off that win is surprising. The Redskins, I know they're good at home. I know they can play at home uh, in their home here. You know, they struggled against the Saints. Saints are an elite offense. The Cowboys are not elite offense, but they look like one last week against maybe the best defense. Uh, I elite. I don't know what to make of this. I don't know what to do here. Um, you know what? I, I decided. Flip a coin. I decided. How do I normally decide these? The home team. Yeah, I got I to gotta stick with I got to stick with it. All right, I'm going to go with uh, the Cowboys here. Split it, Split Pete. It Split it. Um, Man, if that was the real Cowboys both, both, last week. Yeah, I know. Both teams came off impressive wins. It's tough to choose, but. Pete's really the boys. playing the percentages here. Yeah. Did you see uh, AP's uh, shoe get stuck in Luke Keekley's? Yeah, uh, that was wild. Yeah. How does that happen? I don't know. You see AP? Yeah. That was wild. AP, something else. Pops his own shoulder back in place last Monday and then plays in this this last game. Man ran, boys. Ran for 90. And what about that knee that years. hit to the knees? Yeah, guy's an animal, absolute animal. Moving on. Sign him up. Sign him up. We're moving on though. Bengals, Chiefs. That's another great That's game. That's a good game. Another good game. Um, 
man, the Bengals needed needed to win. I keep saying it in other videos. That loss against Steelers, they played good, but they kind of needed to win that game. Looking for, Division game, they were home and looking forward. I'm taking the Chiefs here. Uh, they got too much mm-hmm. offense for the Bengals. Bengals got a pretty solid team, though. But I'm taking the Chiefs. Taking the Chiefs, Chiefs. as well. I think the Chiefs, uh, I think they've been showing a lot this year. So, uh, yeah. Yeah? They're at home. Go with the home team. They are at Arrowhead. I like them at Arrowhead. They did play a great game Sunday. Mm-hmm. It was just like whoever whoever had the ball last was going to win the game yeah. for that game. So, um, yeah, I think they're just too much too much to handle. Yeah, I agree. Got to go with the Chiefs here. I okay. do think this is going to be a good game. The Bengals have been uh, playing really – I would. I mean, I want to say surprising, but they've been playing well. Sorry, Bengals fan. Sorry, Bengals fan. Love you. Kind of. <laughs> Uh, speaking of good games, mm. the Giants are playing the Falcons on Monday Night Football. <laughs> um, man, just terrible football versus just injuries everywhere, everywhere. Uh, but I, I'm still gonna take the Falcons. The Ooh, Giants are injuries everywhere. Ooh. I'm taking injuries over terrible football. Yeah, I'm never picking the Giants ever again. They're just a mess. Yeah, absolute mess. I don't know what's going on with them. Picking, picking the Falcons. At home. Uh, yeah, the home does matter. Yeah, I'm taking the home team here. Okay. This is interesting, though. This is where things are going to get interesting. The bye week you're talking about? Yeah, we got four teams. We got now. four. We've never had to handle four. We have had we have had to handle two. I know Pete's been preparing for this after no, last week's debacle. Pete, you got your notes over there? Most important thing of the video. Who's going to win the bye week? Brought to you by Vagisil. FanDuel, I was going to say. Right. <laughs> I was going to say FanDuel. Vag- we're working on the Vagisil promo. so Are we? There. I don't think we are. I didn't think I'm working on it, at least. Yeah, okay. you're working on it. Okay. <laughs> I know who's going to lose the bye week. Who's going to lose the bye week? The Raiders. They're, just be- they're just losing everything. The Raiders. Yeah, they're losing everything. I, I think, I mean, you're going to have a week away from the team, and I think the players are going to be like, Jesus, like, just look Rudin at us. Look at, our, look at our roster. Like, they're, they're just not going to be motivated to come back because they – I, I feel like – I feel like they're not they're not uh they're not they're not liking Gruden. They're not liking him at all. So yeah, they're gonna lose it. I got I got two. Maybe they just need a break though. Maybe they just need a break and like, all right, let's get back to Kind of like a like a week break up with John Gruden. Yeah. And come but back to it. Like, oh, I miss they're, you. They're just not a break. You, babe. They're just on a break. Yeah. I miss you, no, babe. no, no. <laughs> no. Babe, no. man. Man. I missed you, babe. I got I got two points here. Two points. All right, let's hear them. Steelers had a great division win. Okay. They had some momentum. This is not what they need. This is not what they need. This is not what they need. Well, Aaron, Aaron Rodgers is a weak back. Can they get Bell back? He's not. He's even if he comes back, he's not going to play as much as he thinks he's going to play. And uh, if I'm the Steelers too, the second he signs the papers, I'm trading him. And um, Aaron Rodgers, a week off that knee. I, I mean, I hate the Packers, but they're looking mighty good for this bye week. Mighty good. Mighty good. Mm-hmm. So the Packers win the bye week? It's between them and the Seahawks, but the Seahawks is just like, huh? Eh. Yeah, the Raiders sure. just blow. Seahawks are, yeah, like you said, just, uh. uh and I was going to go with the Packers because you made, you made a good argument. See you that? made a good point. Uh, Rodgers Rogers needs to rest up the knee, but no. I'm not going with the Packers. I'm going with the Steelers because Le'Veon Bell apparently said he's coming back. He hasn't training, reported yet. Training camp Monday. So that's for next week. They don't need them this week. They don't need anybody this week because they got to buy. So I'm going to go with the Steelers. But uh, you made a good argument with the Packers, either one. Pete? Pete we love we love to hear your thoughts, Pete. The Dar- fans would Dar- love Dar- to hear Break it down Dar- for Dar- us, Pete. Uh, you guys already kind of talked about it. Just tell us your favorite so part yours? about each of the teams. How about that? Favorite about each team? Yeah. What's your favorite part about the Steelers, Packers, Seahawks, and Raiders? Give us your favorite player on each team. Favorite, oh, player, favorite each player on each team? Yeah, each I like team. that. Start uh, left to right. Steelers, Antonio Brown. Okay. Favorite no. player or best player? Both. No. Favorite player. Favorite. Okay. And he's the best player on the team. Packers. Be very careful with this one, Pete. Packers. Mike very. McCarthy. Um, <laughs> Rogers knee. Rogers Ooh. knee. No. It doesn't work like that. Really sense. Um, Geronimo. That's tough. You got to pick one. I'll pick, pick one. one. Think, Can I pick one? Let me think about it. Equinemia St. Brown, oh, Notre Dame <laughs> wide receiver. <laughs> and because of his name. <laughs> what a name on that. What a name. And a big catch last night. Big catch. Packers should have lost. They should have uh, lost. You know, I like Randall Cobb. Okay. Got, Randall- res- got respect for him. 
Okay, how about the Seahawks? Seahawks. Russell Wilson. <laughs> Bobby. Booby. Is that your Pete voice? That's we'll go... Uh, <laughs> I don't even know. We'll go uh, Shaquem. Ooh, Ooh, wild card. Wow. Okay, how about the, ra- the Raiders? The Raiders. Amari Cooper. Oh. Come on, the Titans. <laughs> <laughs> no, he's not. Okay. You never know, though. He, never know. Would you give up? They would got you, the bye week. Would you? That would you, was... Would you, Pete's well, favorite players of the that's week. Gotta Stay ask, tuned that's for gotta, next week. That's what you ask me every week is the favorite player on each <laughs> bye team. Pete's <laughs> bye week favorite players. Brought to you by Vagisil. <laughs> FanDuel. No, it's not Vagisil. It's FanDuel. It's FanDuel. For I just wanted to say time. Vagisil. We're actually partnered with FanDuel. We're not partnered with... with don't give him a, a plug. Don't give him yeah, a plug. I don't, I don't, I'm not even going to give it to him. Uh, follow our Twitter, Frogs underscore Angels. Got a, had th- had an extra space there in the graphics, so I thought I'd throw in there, throw that in there. Uh, cute. Got some good talk on on the Twitter. You know, maybe some stuff you may hear on on, on the there. Uh, but yeah, I sound like an old man. Uh, I'm getting there. I'm the I'm leg. getting to be a big boy. Oh boy! <laughs> You've almost peaked. Peaked. <laughs> We're just getting started here. Okay. Here, uh, but we're you on the peak of the mountain, peak. but really we're only halfway up. That's true. You're supposed to say that speech. Yeah, but it's well, whatever. We're working on it. Whatever, whatever, Trevor. Whatever, Trevor. Whatever, Trevor. Uh, Frog or Danny. Ten k is a subscriber goal. We would be much appreciative if you liked and subscribed to our videos. Uh, we have daily football contents. Uh, sometimes even basketball. We did a baseball video. We got we got a lot of crap going along here. Crap. crap. What's up, crap? <laughs> well, it's quality crap. So you're, you're done with this this promo. Yeah, Go yeah, ahead and like and Pete. subscribe uh, our videos. Yeah. It would be much appreciated. Uh, we're growing every single day. Uh, 10K is a subscriber goal. Holy crap. I can't speak. You know so, what? Yeah, go ahead and take it over. Week. Please, I'm taking it over you. next week. All right. Junior, you can take over this spot. Uh, Click the fucking button. That, <laughs> <laughs> that, that was our video, uh, I guess. Hope you guys like our pickums. I'm gonna enjoy this lead while it lasts because I don't think it's gonna last for long. No I'm not confident in my lead. You're not confident. I'm a little nervous. You, you see, Danny, I hear the footsteps. You see, you see, Danny coming up. I hear the uh-huh. not your footsteps. I hear the footsteps. If if my footsteps were coming, they'd be a little bit louder than everybody else's though. With those Is it Vontae's perfect footsteps? No, he's not in our pickums. You see. You see <laughs> I'm going to pull this back up here. I don't want to leave this screen up there too long. Because I'm going to talk about Vont- Vontae's perfect now. You see the the whole thing, how he's a dirty player. It's being brought up again. And he uh, pointed at Juju that you're next. But everyone's making a big deal. You you apparently can't you apparently can't tell someone you're next. You basically, He's basically saying he's going to hit him. Okay. Can everybody agree with that? Yes. Yeah, can I just make, add something no. real quick here? No. Okay. Okay. You can't tell somebody you're going to hit him while sure. playing football. But you can go tell somebody about their mother being it's something inappropriate about their mother. You notice that? Yeah. Well, sure. <laughs> sure. I don't, I don't hear all the stress talk. You know, you close. know they're saying something about each other's mothers. Maybe. Probably not. <laughs> I, bet, I bet you they are. Maybe like, how's your mother? Maybe like ten years ago. Yo, <laughs> mama. Yeah, I bet you you're, it goes on. But you're not allowed to basically say I'm going to come hit a, you. It's a threat, though. That's assault, it's brother. Football. He's threatening to do what his job is and That's hit not, you. No, he's not saying like. I mean, what are you doing? Nobody Antonio? knows what, what he meant. He's pointing. Well, I know. No one knows. What I don't meant. think he puts his head down on purpose. Some players just just do that. They can't really help themselves. They just do it because they're not too smart and they want to. I, I don't think he's that. I mean, he's he's a dirty player. Dirty, but I mean, I, didn't Juju hit him and stand over him last year? Yeah. Yeah. Juju should be. should be next. He should be. He should be. Keep your head in a swivel. Not, not the like, <laughs> not cheap shot. Not just tackle. Spear him. Just yeah, tackle. That's all, that's all I'm saying. Like, just give him a hard tackle. That's fine. Yeah. You can put your body you're weight on those gonna, receivers. You're always not going to do that. You can put your body weight on the receivers. Yeah. Do it. Ten k of subscribe subscriber goal. Oh, Danny already went over this. Oh, okay. Oh, uh, that's going to do it for this one. Thanks for go watching. ahead and like and subscribe. This was the kind of off the reels one. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. All right. Okay. Goodbye. Yeah. Bye. Take care. <laughs> what?